so today on Little Girl, we're going to be doing a DIY. We'll be making, um, like, safety pin bracelets. You can also make, um, with this DIY, you can also make, uh, headbands, necklaces, or, like, keychains. You can also make, like, um, a regular ring. So the things you will need are scissors, safety pins, little gems, and string so the first thing you'll be doing is taking your string and your scissors and cutting however you long want however you want it i'm going to be making a necklace and it's going to be really long like this long i already had made a bracelet and i will be giving this to you know, somebody who likes the color, like this color that I use. And with these four easy steps, you'll be making um, bracelets, headbands, or necklace like that. So after you cut your string, you just want to put your scissors to the side. And your string to the side. And just get um, any color, like you can use different colored safety pins. Here I have purple, blue, black, and pink. So I used blue last time with the bracelet. I'm going to be using pink this time for the necklace. So with your gems and your safety pin, you can just pick out any kind of gems, okay? And just putting them on there. So I'm just going to be using this really cute flower one with this butter pink butterfly. Um, and just a couple of these small ones. And then stick your gems to the side. No one heard of that. So first, you just take your gem. And put it on your safety pads. <coughs> and then continue doing that. So when you finished putting them all on, they should look like this. So the safety pin wasn't big enough, but you can also get big ones. Um, but the safety pin that I'm using isn't big enough, so only... Four of them were able to be on, but I had gotten seven. So the three extra ones that I have, I'm just going to put them back in here. With my gems. Then you want to close your safety pin. With You should be able to have like a little space left right there. A little space left. To be able to close your safety pin and this is really easy and sometimes it is hard depending on the gems you are using depending on the little gems you are using so we're going to just get our string and tie it through the little circle that you see at the bottom, not the top, the bottom of your safety pin. Just put it right through. And then the final step, the fourth step, the trap, is really easy. Just tie it. <coughs> Sorry, I'm a little sick, but I still wanted to make this video for you. So, because I haven't made a video in a long time. So, from now, I'm going to be making videos on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Tuesdays and Thursdays. So, here's our, like, necklace here. 
And since it was a necklace, I wanted to use the big pink butterfly. So you can make many, many more. You can even make um, a ring just using string and your little beads. So the first step was um, cutting the string. The second step was picking out your gems. The third was placing them on your safety pins and then closing. And the fourth was tying it. So, here is what we have. I did it with the blue, but it was just a bracelet. And I used different colors. I used every single color. <clears throat> and with the pink, I just used the, like, the main color with the butterfly. And um, the rest of them were just different kind of colors. And you can also make uh, many, many, many more things. Um, but I just wanted to show you a little quick video of how you could make your own bracelet and necklace and many, many more things. So that was it for this DIY. And there will probably be many, 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 many more. Um, and instead of just doing it for Tuesdays and Thursdays, I might be doing it every day. I skipped Monday because I was at doctors, and all I found out was I was just, like, um, had a little <clears throat> cold. But I still had fun, went out with my mom and my sister and got my nails done. But, you don't, like, if you're a YouTuber, then you don't have to do a video every single day but you know if you really love youtube and everybody on it then you could just make a video um and um i know my very first video of um how to make a finger cast and a fan i got 24 views and since i'm a really really young beginner like in my category of age, but I'm not like really young. It's like, to me it's kind of hard getting a lot of views. So it would be really nice if you commented and gave me nice comments. And, you know, subscribed and liked. And my birthday was on Monday. I'm 10 now. I'm not 9. I'm 10 now. And my birthday wasn't as fun as I wanted it to be, but, you know, maybe it is going to be next year. This is my little butterfly over here. She accompanied.